Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Sky Factory Hello, 4. Everybody. And Isaac. Welcome back. Shut up, Isaac. Oh. Or should I say, nuclear reactor? Shut up, because it's too loud, Isaac, and I hate it. I'm leaving. You're not a fan? I'm this? out. All right. I mean, Nick, we've got. Where's our the, super uh, silencer, Isaac? Nick. Put Freaking, it down. Here we go. Super sound muffler. Boom. Nice and quiet. There's still a bit of sound. Isaac, this ain't muffling. This, there we go. There oh, we look, go. its range goes up. Do you see that? In the, yeah, I've been, in, in I've been, there, I've been changing its oh. range, man. Oh, I It's see. only had a range of eight. I reckon these <laughs> little <laughs> electromagnets you, were. You can, can we turn it up? to 256. <laughs> <laughs> Just silence Where is the this entire my life? <laughs> oh, it's amazing. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, oh, you can blacklist okay. this. Yeah, mental. you can. It's got a whole. It's got like every Jesus. sound in the game. So you can uh, whitelist and blacklist certain sounds. That's incredible. Yeah, right, I'm gonna bring this back down to like 16 nicks. I don't want the whole yeah. base to be. Like, I want to hear those Nick. pigs, man. I want to hear them oink up, you know? Exactly. It's like the guy who donated his ribs to me suddenly starts giving his interviews and there's nothing coming out of his mouth. Isaac, because he's been muffled. We should. Um, we should silence the entire base, but whitelist the sound of pigs. Yeah. And then just <laughs> add horses. <laughs> I agree just with have this. those guys around. Oh, man. So, Nick, in the last episode, we set up our first nuclear fusion reactor. And we have it right here, right now, running at 98% efficiency, Nick, producing a whopping 172,000 redstone flux per tick. Flippin' heck. Oh, I'm, it's uh, beautiful. I'm quite happy with this, man. Beautiful. It is so beautiful. Am I, actually, like we said last time, you know, everything is going okay with this. Yeah. Um, and I'm going to celebrate this feat, Isaac, by building a giant iron toilet. Um, oh. Which is where I'm starting today because... A giant iron toilet? I need, Isaac, pig poo, Isaac. Nick. Or, or your you, poo. Did Nick, 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 we've talked before now about... Your off-camera fetishes, Nick, and we we don't want those coming in and and infiltrating the video. Okay, what you get up to off-camera is your own business, Nick. If you want to go and find some pig poo, that's fine. But here at the GOC Sandwich headquarters, Nick, it's very unsanitary. Isaac, right? Isaac, Isaac. But have you like if you know the co you know like that coffee where they like feed the coffee beans to meerkats and then they crap it out and then people yeah. like, like it's a delicacy. That's what maybe. Doing the same to pigs and then using that as fertilizer for maybe like bread or something makes better sandwiches, mm. Isaac. Maybe. You have thought of that one. It's possible. Is it something to do with like the, the, the stomach acid that makes that happen? I have no idea, man. I just find it amazing. I think my dad um, bought some once. <laughs> and he was, right, like, okay. he was like, oh, I've got this new coffee. It's really good. And I was like, oh, really? How come? And he's like, oh, yeah, it's because they fed, fed it to like meerkats. And then they pooed it out. Nice. And I was like, you know what? Oh, now I want it. <laughs> I didn't want it before. Now I want it. <laughs> is there any is there any food, Nick, that you consume on a daily basis that you think would taste better if it went through the, the bowel system of a meerkat first? Mm, good question. Um, maybe like jam. Jam? Yeah. Oh, man. Like, you reckon jam? Maybe Jam that's how is. marmalade is made, Isaac. Oh. That's why it's love it or hate it. Yeah, man, oh. man. It's, not, it's marmite, right? Not marmite. Marmite. Mar 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 <laughs> <laughs> same thing, yeah. Isaac. It's all the same. <laughs> marmalade, you either love it or you hate it. <laughs> <laughs> All those oh. odd marmite, marmalade hitters out there. <laughs> oh, it's just one guy outside, you know, like Tesco with his big ban marmalade sign. <laughs> you know, that's me. And that's me, Isaac. That's me. Oh, man. Oh, How man. do you feel about, uh, about marmalade, man? Marmalade? God, I think the last time I had marmalade, Isaac, I was in like, you know, early primary school. Yeah. Um, I, have, I also have not had marmalade in a very long time. Um, it's just not, it's just not. Not not up there enough, man. You know, it needs to. Uh, I feel like the marmalade industry. They really need to get the. Need to, they need to get their own thing, right? Like it's too close to jam, but not as good as jam. Yeah, it's like fake jam. It is. It's like fake it's jam. Like how turkeys are fake chickens, right? Yeah, ex marmalade exactly. Is fake jam. <laughs> At least marmite is edgy enough to actually warrant itself being different, right? Exactly, man. Exactly. Maybe that's how that happened. Maybe marmite was originally marmalade, but the marmalade industry realized that they weren't going to get anywhere with jam being so good that they just thought, you know, we need our own thing. Yeah, so they invented, they were like, you know, 
Uh, it's, it's Australian, is it? They're like, all right, f*** it, lads. <laughs> <laughs> and then they just fed all the marmalade to the meerkats <laughs> that they had lying around in the factory. <laughs> yep. And then the meerkats tell all the marmite and then yep. they, they they had it and they're like oh crikey this tastes great <laughs> and then some of them were like oh no that's disgusting and then that's how it <laughs> was invented Isaac. that's how that's, that's how, how marmite, marmite came to be the, the epic story of marmite yep yeah <laughs> that's the way it goes <laughs> if legend is to be believed <laughs> Oh, man, all uh, those native uh, meerkats down, in the, down under. <laughs> exactly, man. Meerkat heaven. Oh. Here we go. Oh, man. Uh, so did you, uh, do you want to explain what you're doing, Nick? Uh, hi, the, everyone. Uh, Welcome why back. Why you actually need so, this goodness. So, basically, me and Isaac have been looking at the quests. And uh, one of the things that we need uh, for a quest is the ultimate singularity. Um, mm. For the ultimate singularity, you need all the regular singularities. And to get regular singularity ting... That you need ten thousand of the ting, right? So let's say you need a donut. You need, you want a donut um, singularity. You need ten thousand donuts. So yeah. we thought the best way to get all these items would be through our trusty old hopping bonsai pots. Um, however, these are going to be a bit slow in their current state. So I'm going to make some serious mulch, Isaac, and that's the, the motto for this. Oh. Serious mulch. Is mulch like slang for for cash? Uh, yeah. You're going to make some serious gonna, gonna mulch? going to make some serious mulch to make some serious mulch, Isaac. Nice. Yeah, Nice, man. nice, nice. Whilst you work on that, Nick, I'm about to blow up a singularity in an ender dust, which should... Yeah, well, I'm making theory, a toilet, Isaac, so get out of it. Oh, please! Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, oh, oh, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, you, I got it. You all right, Nick? man? <laughs> I got it, okay. So, um, for whatever reason, I was under the impression that... Um, my our base was not going to um to blow up right like, oh, like the right. things were not going to disappear um and so oh I'm, am i falling wait are you all right isaac i'm so confused oh i did fall okay i'm fine i'm fine okay i'm back so what i did is i placed down my singularity my ender dust and a tiny tnt right right because you need to blow up the ender dust and the tiny tnt to get the two quantum entangled singularities to connect up the two quantum rings, right? Right. However, when I blew up the tiny TNT, a hole in the floor was created and my two tiny quantum entangled singularities began falling rapidly into the void. Oh my right? God. The ones that we've been working between episodes to get by pumping so much cobblestone into that mm -hmm. 64K ME drive. Yeah. And so at that point, I myself jumped through the hole, chasing after it into the void. And just at the last minute, Nick, as it was milli milli inches away from hitting oh God, the void milli inches milli inches i grabbed inches. it in my mouth and i caught both quantum entanglement you bloody next. legend isaac i know you, you crazy boy <laughs> i know what is the why is there no oh my god don't worry don't worry about this don't worry about this <laughs> you <laughs> Don't, don't, you know, this is under construction, Isaac. You're not allowed to hate on it, all right? <laughs> you know when you put so much time into building a base that looks halfway decent, <laughs> and then the freaking guy comes on and starts building a f off big iron toilet. <laughs> oh, my God. It's going to be dual flush, Isaac. Don't hate on it, all right? It's going to be dual flush. All right. All right. I believe in you, man. Um... <laughs> so don't let me down. No, I won't. Don't you worry. <laughs> I oh. really won't let you down. <laughs> oh, my. Oh. Uh. I have faith, Nick. I have faith. All right. Thanks, All man. Right. So do I, I think. So, yeah. Whilst you work on that, I'm going to set up two uh, quantum link chambers, which should finally, Nick, allow us uh, to re-engage our offshore accounts and actually begin auto-crafting. Okay, this Finally. is good. Finally. Which is going to be really useful, Nick, for when we when we eventually go and build an even bigger fusion reactor with this 24 by 24 by 24 max size fusion reactor, Nick, which uh, mm. I'm hoping produces 3.3 million RF per tick because there is a quest to produce to build a fusion reactor that produces 3,333,333 redstone flux per tick. And I've got a sinking feeling inside of me, Nick, that a max size hydrogen reactor might not do no, that. We might have to delve into... Kind of Alternative of, fuel, Isaac. Mm, alternative and fuel. You know what they say about alternative fuel, Isaac? Takes time. It takes time. It takes time. Is that what they say? I have I mean, no I idea, guess that's Isaac. True, right? Yeah. I mean, like, 
Electricity is an alternative fuel for cars, right? And it's taking time, but it's getting there, you know? It's, yeah, yeah, exactly, sure. Isaac. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. You know, it's getting there. It takes time. It takes, takes time. time. Takes time. You um, you drive a hybrid, right? I do, actually, yeah. I do forget that I drive a hybrid because, yeah, it's a, yeah I do drive a hybrid. Do you ever charge it or...? No, it's, like, how it's does that work? like it's not super super hybrid. It's not a plug-in hybrid. Oh, okay. It's just a regular regular ass hybrid. Um, but it's nice, Isaac, because um, it means that you when you're when you want to like crawl really slowly um, in traffic, uh, you don't when you put your foot on the accelerator pedal, the car doesn't like leap forward with a clutch. Mm. It's just a little bit of nice soft motion, Isaac. And you know what they say when you're driving, Isaac? Yep. Um, your car's better uh, when it's soft. Um, exactly, yeah. Yeah. People, uh, fun fact, most big manufacturers are now making their cars softer so that uh, when car crashes happen, they um, don't break. They just bend. And they, they just, just bend. Them back and, yeah, and, and they no, spring no, no. back like... <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You can just bounce bounce off each other. Exactly. Oh, man. Just I think like cars, Isaac. I think, I think we need to break into the, uh, the car market, man. So do I. Maybe we should make a car and call it the the jam car, and it's just made of made of marmite. Because the, the, oh, okay, the jam car. <laughs> yeah, the jam car. It's got it's made of marmite and has a really good sound system. Isaac. All right. <laughs> <laughs> right. This toilet's not going well. I've had to tear it down a bit, but now it's going better. Okay. Do you? Oh, okay. Don't don't <laughs> don't question it. I'm so I'm so worried about about where this is going, Nick. Don't Honestly, worry. I have <laughs> Oh, I should probably explain why the toilet's required. Okay. So, uh for one of the tiers of mulch, uh which is what I'm trying to make. Uh we need I think it's this one, the red mulch. We need Oh no, it's not. It's the ruby mulch. We need fertilizer. And to get fertilizer, you need a sewage composter and from <laughs> excuse me, from the sewage composter uh, we need sewage, and that's uh, made by uh, what? What's the machine again? For the it's like an animal sewage collector, um, which is basically a massive toilet, Isaac. So hence the massive toilet. The massive toilet, to clarify, is not required oh, to make no. this happen. No, no, no. no, okay. So long as we're all on the same page here, uh, the massive toilet there, not part of the setup. That was uh, that, <laughs> that was all part of Nick's Nick's idea. Grand plan. <laughs> No part with of your master flush. plan. Let's not forget. Yeah. Uh, Dwarf your master pl flush. Yeah, of course. Yeah, master flush. Like it's one of those toilets that I don't know if you've ever seen this on YouTube. Probably have because um, we're we're the same person, Isaac. Yeah. Um, like these toilet adverts where they like flush like loads of golf balls down it and like you know <laughs> like just flush like you know like entire animals down it. Like I feel like you know a lot more about. Like toilet specific features than I do, honestly. <laughs> That's what you're about. I don't know what you're about. Like honestly, like I don't even know what dual flush is. Like what? Like, you... Dual flush, man. You know when you got two buttons, like a the 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 button. You've got the button within a button, and you push one of them to make it flush a little bit, and you push the other one to make it flush a lot, depending on oh. your, depending on your your business. Isaac. See, I, we have that. I just always press both. Like I just hit the, I just press the whole thing. You right? monsterizing. The whole reason dual <laughs> flush is invented is that like you can push the little one when you have a wee. Oh man, I've been, okay. Well, this is ridiculous. See, now I'm, I'm you. teaching you the ways here. What do you think it was some kind of safety feature so that kids don't flush themselves down the toilet? Uh, I honestly thought that it was just like a, an, an aesthetic thing. Like they just wanted the button to be cut in half for some reason. No, I was like, you know. Isaac, <laughs> are you, you crazy human. Oh my goodness, now I know. Now you now know. know. It's dual flush, mate. Oh, man. See, Nick, no one can ever say this. Uh, this podcast isn't educational. Man. Exactly. There you go. Exactly. Oh, yeah. I'm happy with my work here, lads. <laughs> 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 oh, man. Oh, you know. yeah. So you, you set out, by the way, at the start, just to clarify, you set out at the start of today's episode to get blue mulch? Uh, blue mulch. Okay, well, let's see how that goes, <laughs> shall we? <laughs> We're 15 minutes in and you've built a toilet. Don't know what you're about, guys. Don't know what you're about. <laughs> oh, man. Is, uh, our, is our toilet going to have uh, door flush? Oh, yeah, actually. I'm going to put, instead of having um, a button, Isaac, I'm going to put two levers on it. <laughs> nice. Here we go. See, why is there not a twist? Where's, where's the, the triple flush? Right? Exactly. So normal is for, like, you know, when you go for a pee. Yeah. 
heavy is when you go for a heavier load, and then like ultra is when you're trying to flush golf balls down the toilet. Exactly, you know? specifically for the golf balls. <laughs> Where's the golf ball button? Yeah, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it's just a, it's a, got a little golf ball like it. Like, oh no, not again. <laughs> <laughs> it's because it's, have... <laughs> golfers are infamous when they do practice Isaac for trying to hit golf balls into toilets instead of um, instead yeah. of holes, golf holes. Oh my god, Isaac, the toilet's flushing out mobs. I just saw three mobs <laughs> come out the back of the toilet. <laughs> oh no, it's all uh, gone yeah, wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, let's get some torches. Oh, the poor guy's over at the water company store, man. Just, you know, they're trying to filter out all these golf balls that are just coming in left, right, and center. You can never win, man. What you can never win. the front door? Isaac, these creepers are making weird sounds, and they're called bouncy creepers, not regular creepers. And they're going, wow, 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 wow. Are you sure they're not, are you sure they're not villagers? No, Isaac, uh, unless they're... <laughs> wah, 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 wah. Oh my God, they're bouncing. Oh my Ooh. goodness, yeah, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get them. bouncing. I can't hear them, one second. My volume is low. Oh, oh you missed it. You'll be able you to hear it into post. oblivion. Bloody weird, man. Oh man. Jesus It's like Christ. a hopping creeper. Oh Crazy. man. <laughs> Crazy. We've not done like any mob farming, Nick. No, we've not, this we've not really needed There's to. not have a single we? mob farmer, no. Usually that's the first thing we always do. Maybe that's why this feels so refreshing, Isaac. Yeah, maybe. We did a little bit for the uh, for the deep mob learning, right? But that's about it. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Okay. Right, animal sewer. Where should I put my quantum ring, Nick? I mean, Isaac, there's only one place to put your quantum ring, Isaac. And I mean, oh, yeah. I'm not sure we can discuss it in this, in this, you know, episode. Uh, oh, okay. So this working area is, is quite small. Do I need a range upgrade? You do need a range add-on, yes. Um, quantum ring. Uh, good question, Isaac. Yeah, it's a little three by three by one, you know, three wide, three tall and one deep. Where do you think I should put this guy? Three wide, three maybe tall, just, one deep. You know, maybe like up here. Up here. Yeah, put him up here. Um, uh, James has always no, wanted I'm, quantum. I'm, I'm, James uh, James has always wanted to flex uh, with some jewelry, so uh, give him a quantum uh, ring, Isaac. Uh, You're right, man. Uh, I'm not going to just because I hate running the cables up through the roof. Oh yeah, right. Like they they always look horrible. I'm gonna just put it uh, somewhere else. Like, don't well, can't we right? use the wireless ME, at Isaac? Wireless ME cables. Is that not a thing? We oh, so you want me to <laughs> you want me to tear down the pre-existing wireless ME, the one that requires two point eight million RFPs, yeah, and repurpose it repurpose to transfer it. the power exactly, up, so it still feels good blocks. about itself, right? Okay, sure. And although I could fly with my angel ring, that's not an angel ring, with my uh, chorus fruit over to the island, Nick. That's not how you get to the offshore account, man. No, you right? must take the plane. But you before must you do, take Isaac, the plane. please, can I have? Oh yeah. Uh, please, can you connect a uh, knobbly end to this animal sewer? Okay, come in. Preparing for descent. Preparing for descent. Cabin crew, prepare for landing. Uh, you want a flux point, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. Do we have any flux points? You didn't even make one? D I thought we had loads, to be honest. You, it's okay, I do have one. Here you go. Boom. All Thanks, right. man. Over and out. Cabin crew, prepare for takeoff. Preparing for liftoff. <laughs> are, you, are you to the moon, Isaac? <laughs> yep. Is that where you've put it? <laughs> it's like we've, we've, we've we have talked about it. Bank on the moon. Yeah, man. We don't. Have, uh, we don't. Have, I wish we, we. When was the last time we played a, a pack that had Galacticraft in it, man? I feel like Bloody we've not been to other planets. Yeah, we need to. Uh, we need to play a pack with Galacticraft, dude. I know, right? I wanna. I wanna put stuff on on the moon. Right. Why can't we build a bank on the moon, Jab? Exactly. You, exactly. You. You guy. You. You ever, uh, you ever think about being an astronaut, Nick? Um, no. However, I know some people who would not bat an eyelid when if if I said to them, "Would you, if you um could go to the moon or Mars right now, would you forever?" And they're like, "Yeah, of course, a hundred percent." Forever, like forever, just, never coming just, back. Oh wow, yeah, man, pretty wild, right? Wow, that is really wild, especially with the not batting an eyelid thing, like. Yeah, oh like they, goodness. I feel like they win all of the staring contests, Isaac. I'm gonna say, like, I, I bat my eyelids just, you know, instinctively at least once, yeah, every minute or so, you know. So I mean, the fact that they can do it <laughs> without batting an eyelid is crazy, Isaac. The pigs that have been populated, the, the pigs that were part of the lab research experiment a few episodes ago, are now being picked up by hand 
and placed in the toilet. <laughs> you know, like, I didn't think you were placing the pigs directly into the toilet. Oh, no, Jesus Isaac, Christ. of course I am. <laughs> what did you think this whole, the whole shebang was for, Isaac? They are being put in the toilet bowl. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, Nick. We're going to have Peter on our backsides in no time. Oh, I know, Jeez. I know. It's all right, Isaac. We, we use the Peter sayings, so we're in their good books. So let's just hope That's they true, don't come are. for inspection. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But it's okay, Nick. They won't inspect us because we, um, we don't say kettle of fish anymore. So exactly. We illegal. say um, bowl of fish. Kettle of, bowl uh, of fish. Bowl of fish. <laughs> it's not my bowl of fish. It's not my yeah. bowl of fish. <laughs> right. Are you... Oh my God. Isaac, one of them sticking their head out of the toilet through the iron. It's horrible. <laughs> <laughs> no, get out of here. Get back in, you you horrible thing. Oh, you horrible you monster. Horrible monster. Oh, I'm back. Oh, it's actually yeah, a quick... Isaac, we are picking up the poo. Holy nice. crap. Nice. I can hear nice, it as nice, well. Nice. It's not oh, like yeah, a sloshy this. sound. Oh, yeah, they're fluid sewage. Nice. Nice, nice. Okay, so the next bit is the uh, fertilizer maker. Uh, here we go. You can also put uh, some speed upgrades into that thing to make it, you know, pull sewage even faster. Mm. If mm. that's your... Uh, Might do. Your cup of tea. Cup of tea. That's it. That's my cup of tea. Your cup of tea? Cup of tea. Cup of tea. Is that, uh, is that an English saying? Or is that like a universal Probably. saying? Cup of tea. Sounds like uh, something that... British people would say, right? Yeah, yeah. Th those guys. <laughs> like, um, crikey. Oh, no, wait, that's Aussie. Crack. <laughs> crikey. <laughs> that's, that's, the word crikey was invented by the Marmite creators because they were so shocked when uh, the meerkats ate the marmalade that they just yeah. blurted out a completely new word, right? It wasn't even on purpose. Like, no. It, it was, just turns it out that meerkats reaction. love marmalades. Exactly. Like, they just love it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Do love a meerkat, Isaac. Yeah? Yeah. Do you, uh, do you have one? Yeah, man. I I feed it mar 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 marmalades. <laughs> marmalade diet. And, 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 and coffee produce beans. marmite. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah. Nice, nice, so nice. it's like, it is like bouncy AF, Isaac. It's always like buzzing on the caffeine, like vibrating. <laughs> so I give it some marmalade to calm it down, but then it gets a sugar rush. I don't think I'm a very good meerkat owner, to be honest, Isaac, but I am enjoying yeah. great coffee and marmite. I mean, that's all that matters, right? Exactly. Honestly. Would you, uh, would you ever go for an exotic pet? I think we talked before about who you really want to have a monkey as a pet because they yeah, can use exactly. Instagram. Yeah, exactly. That was your exactly. just <laughs> Yeah, because they can use Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> like, that is that is lit, man. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> yeah, if you haven't seen the episode, Nick went on for so long about how he really wants a monkey because monkeys can do human things. <laughs> and then... Um... <laughs> I think in that case, I should probably just have a baby. <laughs> That's That was my response. I was nah, like, I just mate. want a child. I want a monkey. <laughs> oh. Yeah, I guess monkeys, you know, you never have to pay for monkeys to go to, uh, to school. To education, right? Exactly, yeah. right? I don't have to send my monkey to private school. I'll just give it a phone with Instagram on it. I mean, if you're a bad monkey owner, then you won. If you're a good monkey owner, Nick, you'll pony up and send them to a private school, man. To private school. Can you imagine, like, a monkey in private? I mean... <laughs> I wonder if they take it, you know, like if, a regular if you pay them school. anywhere. You're like, oh yeah, this is, you know, <laughs> yeah. this is Polly and Dress uh, it up, you she's know, joining year it. seven a bit late because, you know, her birthday is <laughs> unknown. <laughs> and then, and then they'll, they'll pick the poor, the poor bastard that has to, you know, like be Polly's like person. Lab you know? it and yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, right, Polly, go and sit next to James and James like, oh, Kid <laughs> out. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! Like, Paul, like James, you have to show Polly around the school. Like you know, make sure she gets to where she needs to be. And James, like, oh Christ! <laughs> I think. I mean, it's I feel like great. it could work, man. Yeah, yeah I agree. Definitely, I agree, Isaac. Definitely. Oh All man! Right. I need so much quartz glass, and I also need a lot more of oh, this pure. Christ. Never quartz. Here we go. Boom, boom. All right. How's the uh, how's the mulch game going? Nick? It's going well. I'm just rooting power to our um, our uh, new uh, sewage machine. Oh, the pigs, the pigs are going to escape, man. I know. I know. I'm I'm just being a 
I'm being a bit. I need to be a bit careful. Unless you can donate another knobbly end just to the other side. Um, I, I, I probably could have done Nick. Uh, uh, here yeah. Go. Here you go. I feel. Oh gosh. Yeah. <laughs> Does this need to be in a specific orientation? This sewage composter. Uh, I don't think so, Nick. No, I don't think okay, so. Okay, this is good. Yeah. If you could just whack it, I, I'll make a, a hole. There's a hole on this side. I just want to. Okay, okay. I'm just making the making the components. Flux point. Kerpa. Where am I putting this bad boy? Just over here. Uh, just over there. Thanks, man. Okay. Boom. Thank you. Right. Are you getting poo? No. Okay. Yeah, you don't, they don't auto eject. You don't need to have a pipe going through the, to these. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. I guess yeah, that, so some kind of fluid conduit would done. be necessary. Um, okay. I would probably move this underneath, Nick. Like sure, I move the sure. sewage composter down. Do you know what yeah, I mean? I'll just have, have the only thing at the bottom of the toilet be the sewage collector. Y yeah. Otherwise, that... it kind of ruins the whole toilet aesthetic when you start yeah, to be the I bottom might have of the. Yeah, I some covers here. This toilet with some really bad plumbing. Uh, <laughs> Exceptionally bad toilet Exceptionally plumbing. Exceptionally bad plumbing. That's the uh, the motto here. Here we go. Okay. You reckon that could work, like reverse psychology wise? If you uh, had a plumbing company and your uh, your motto was, you know, Nick's plumbers. Exceptionally bad plumbing. Maybe, you know. You know do you reckon you could, you could reverse engineer people into thinking like, why would somebody, you know, advertise their terrible plumbing? They must Maybe be so they good. want to, to just see how bad we are by using our services, right? Of course. Because, I mean, when you think about it, Nick, only a terrible, only a fantastic plumbing company would have the guts to say that they're a terrible plumbing company, right? Exactly. I think that this is breaking breaking some rules here, Isaac, and I, th and I like it. Right, let's make some freaking mulch. Here we oh, go. Oh, man, look at that. 30 minutes in. <laughs> <laughs> the toilet has been taken care of. <laughs> That's not what you're on about, lads. <laughs> All right. Man, we need a better food sauce. I know I keep saying it every single freaking time, man, but... I'm so hungry, and I, it feels wasteful to eat Coral's fruit every time, man. Yeah, man. So wasteful. So wasteful. Yeah, I'm getting, I'm freaking blowing through the mulch, man. Yeah? I'm getting two stacks of the stuff, even though we probably don't need two stacks of the stuff or anywhere near it. I'm into it. So we're, we're never going to need mulch again, Isaac, once do I'm done with this. Do you need the previous tier of mulch to go up to the next you tier? You do. You do. Oh, okay. Okay, this is good. Yeah, we definitely don't need two stacks of mulch. Um... <laughs> <laughs> but who knows, so Isaac, just, later just... down the line when you're like, oh, Nick, we're going to need a troll bonsai farm. And I'm like, oh, Isaac, well, got you covered, mate. Got you covered. Kind of feels like you're just wasting our cocoa beans for the sake of wasting shh, our shh, cocoa beans. Shh, don't wait, don't wait. <laughs> the cocoa beans have been wasted. There's no more. I can't waste anymore. Oh, Isaac, you put speed upgrades in this. Thank you. Um, I did, man. I did. I've been following you around putting speed upgrades and stuff. Don't worry about oh, it. You, you boy. Right, pigs, give me all you've got. Let me, if I feed them, Isaac, do you reckon they'll produce more sh Um, I think you just put more pigs in, man. Put more pigs in, right. Well, that's music to my ears. Here we go. Just uh, slam more pigs and get slam some Slam pig more seeds. pigs in there. Make some pig seeds. Here we freaking go. Get some pig seeds, you know, grows on grass, the mod. Grows and, on uh, grass. Grows on grass. What and a boom. name. <laughs> okay, I think I need to provide power to this side of the, the system for this to work. I think that's how that's done. So I think I need to bring over an energy acceptor, connect up a little bit of power, and then I think so. I think once it's up and running, the quantum ring will transfer power across the quantum realm. But to get it kickstarted, I think I need power on both ends, right? Right. You know what I mean? Like right now, there's no power going to the quantum ring that's on our offshore account. Sure, sure. You need a little bit. So of a, you need a little Jenny. It can't turn on. Yeah. Generator yeah. there. Just a just a little bit of Jenny. Nick, he's done it. Oh my God. He has done it. We have connected our molecular assemblers, Nick. Our offshore heaven is online. Oh, I like it, Isaac, because it's offshore, but it's online. You legend. I had to, uh, apparently I had to put out an energy cell because this guy needed like a buffer of power or something. Nevertheless, Nick, it is online. It is up. It is running. Our molecular assemblers are online. And so mm -hmm. now, if I fly it back and we put down like an ME uh, interface terminal, we should... Be able to, you know, put patterns into these from home base. Like we'd have to fly over here to nice. put patterns in, right? Yeah. So that yeah. should be real nice. Real nice. I'm gonna VPN into our, our offshore bank eyes. Exactly. Like, you know, it's gonna be exactly. unreal. Just for extra security, you know. Mm-hmm. Gotta have that VPN. This episode is proudly sponsored by Insert whatever VPN is sponsoring everyone these days. Is these days? Oh my God! <laughs> Visit jankvpn dot ru for your uh, <laughs> yep. for your. <laughs> <laughs> Jankvpn.ru <laughs> The world's most secure VPN. Yeah.
There we go, piggies. Get in the toilet. Here we go. Again, Nick, I feel like you could use your branding for some, for some real, you know, um, like reverse psychology shenanigans, right? Like people, they see the word janky, Nick, and they're like, there's no way this guy's janky, right? No one who is janky. You know, this guy must be so confident that he's not janky. Exactly. But Boy, are they just, wrong. We gotta watch him. Yeah. <laughs> 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 and so, if you if you make something called Jank VPN, people are gonna be like, "There's no way it's a yeah. bad VPN." Only somebody with I'm a just gonna call it a bad VPN. VPN. Bad VPN. Dot Roo. Dot Roo. <laughs> <laughs> Can you get a dot Ru domain name? Is that like is that possible? Of course, of course. Where do you I think? I don't know, man. Of course you can. Well, yeah, well, I mean, like you know, certain some domains are they're, they're quite like um like some countries keep their domains. Close to the chest, right? Is, dot, is dot Rude like super exclusive? Do I have to? I be, don't know, right? Maybe I have to be Putin's mate. Isaac. That's what I'm thinking. Maybe you have to have like a be part of, you know, Putin's in a gang. Yeah, to, to get to get access the Putin gang. <laughs> exactly. Oh, we get exactly. some serious pooage, Isaac. Nice. This is good <laughs> music to my ears. How do I feed pigs? Is it wheat? Do I give them loads of wheat? Carrots. 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 carrots, carrots, carrots. Of course it is. Yeah. 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 How could I forget? Oh, Isaac, are you uh, are you messing around yeah. with the old? Uh, oh, uh, 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 oh my God, uh, I can't fly. Um, uh, uh, I mean, are we are, uh, we, are we okay, <laughs> no. Isaac? I mean, Nick, just um, it's like all our IT systems of our day uh, ransomware on it, and now I have to resort to like paper, doing things on paper. Mm. Is that what's happened, Isaac? There's nothing to be alarmed about. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep. Nothing is, to that, be alarmed all, about. <laughs> this is all I have to he say. He says this there's time. like eh, 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 <laughs> sound behind him. Everything is going to be okay. The reactor's melting warning, down. Warning. Yeah. Warning. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Uh, 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 uh. It's all right, Isaac, because I now have 120 <laughs> minutes of flying time. <laughs> Nice, <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Because, because, because why not? Because we, we get just three stacks of freaking chorus fruit every episode. We are in the money. Why not? Um, um, so I may have just vain mined most of the AE2 system uh, out uh, of existence. Oh, uh, but um, it's fine, Nick. It's fine. Uh, it's just a quick, you know, a quick. Uh, that's pretty. That's quick pretty raw. Job. That's pretty raw, Isaac. Um, uh, um, bish bash bosh. It'll be fine, Nick. All right. All right. Uh, uh, I think I believe you. Um, just have 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 faith, my friend. Right. Okay. okay. Just don't, oh, uh, Isaac, my mulch better be in there. Uh, no, it will be. Like I didn't destroy the. Uh, I, it's just all the cabling. Oh, okay. Gone. That's all right then. Um, and all of the storage and everything. The drives. Are the still drives there. are all right. We. The, you know what, Isaac? We're we're backed up. We've got backup. It's backed yeah. up to the cloud, Isaac. That's why. Are we backed up to the cloud? I have no idea. No, just shh, Isaac. Maybe we should have a replica, replication of all of our stuff on the offshore account, Isaac. That's, yeah, maybe. I don't know how that would happen, like how that would work. We just have to have two of everything. Yeah. Are yeah. you saying we should have, we should take half of all of our stuff and just dump it in an dump offshore account there, that we can't yeah. access, just so it's... <laughs> exactly. That's fair. Yeah. Okay. Just in case disaster strikes. Right, I need to plug up the back of these gas export buses. Is there a... Uh... ME cable nearby. Yeah, there is. Oh, yeah. You've got a whole aura of colors here, Isaac. Also, I know. And I'd oh, go yeah. like this. Yeah. And just, we can, you know, we can always facade over the, the cables in the future. Yeah. You know what I mean? And actually, you only need to come up through one, right? You only need to go like through here. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And I'll just connect it. Do you have do you have spare cable on you? Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. Nice. oh God. No. <laughs> oh, no. Isaac. Isaac, 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 <gasps> this is... I was saved by the fountain, Nick. I landed in the water. Oh, my God. <laughs> Which fountain? The, the centerpiece of the island. Is that dropping water? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the one up... The, the, the fountain. Oh. You know the fountain? Uh... This guy, like, right here. Yeah. The, the, the centerpiece of the island. Oh, right. So wait, I landed do you not, like this. Do you, not, do you not hit the void? Do you just appear? Yeah, no, you fall from the... You've not died yet? I've not died no. yet, man. Hold you know, on. And I was just about to say, Isaac, that's why you eat a stack of chorus fruit at random oh intervals. My. He has actually not died at all. Oh. What? 
I'm looking at the leaderboards. Unbeat zero deaths. Invincible, oh my goodness. Isaac. Invincible. In fairness, I thought I died more than five times, Nick, honestly. But there you uh, go. I am, I'm five deaths in. Okay. Uh, well, nevertheless, I, I've, I've got my uh, flight back again, so I will uh, hook this up. Thanks, man. Here we go. Yeah, no problem, bud. No problem. There we go. Okay. That's reconnected. Nice. Okay. Uh, so now you just need to... Uh, to um, Specify the gases, Nick, that you want to be uh, to be in there. Mm hmm. So I want. Um, so I guess I do. I need to. How do I do that without actually owning it? Uh, so you need. I'm, I'm doing it for you, Nick, but for okay, future thanks. reference, you need uh, just gas tanks. So. Oh, okay. And then you, you use pick that up a gas tank that contains it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, so you want ethylene going into the rotary concentrator, right? Mm -hmm. You need liquid ethylene. Mm -hmm. So boom, ethylene. Is that working? No. Uh, it needs to be. So you need to toggle the operation. Yeah, because you're going to decondensate. Uh, oh no, is that right? Oh no, 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 no. Okay, so for whatever reason, these guys are a bit um, finicky. The mechanism machines, and I'm fairly certain they need power before just like anything will work. Oh, okay. Even though they they start off with they they start off with a full fuel tank, power tank. I don't think they actually do have it. I think it's just like for. I think it's for Shonik. Oh, okay, right. But let's see if I do. Oh no, they should have power from the bottom, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no, so in that case, it's probably just a, um, wait, 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 ethylene. You're trying to make HDPE pellets, mm. which are liquid ethylene and oxygen in a PRC. Liquid ethylene is ethylene being concentrated, rotary concentrator, decondensed. So we are concentrating. Um, and then this is not working for you. No. Right. If we put down the rotary condensator like this, see this connects here. So if I get rid of this and I put this here, the fact that that doesn't work is mind boggling. So that leads me to believe that this needs to face the other way. And that works. Okay. Okay. All right. So it would seem, Nick, that the problem is the rotary condensator doesn't auto eject. Right, okay. Right, it doesn't push its fluids out. You have to pull them out from this specific side. And the same is true with the gas here. The reason the ethylene wasn't going to go in is because it has one very specific input side, and that right. is this left side here. Sure. So we need to put a like, gas terminal there, or a gas uh, x purpose there, and then put in the tank with the uh, ethylene, which I don't have just yet, but let me go and grab some. If I throw that down in there... Now the system should be working. Yeah, look at that. Everything is working as intended now. Beautiful. So yeah, this is set to go. So hopefully um, we can, once the, the pigs produce poo over time and once that produces enough HDPE over, HDP over time, we can get through the tears, get through the mulch yes. tears. Yes. Oh man, that took some doing, man. That took some freaking yeah, doing. Um, I've spent that. we laying the foundations. Yes, foundations are being uh, are being lain. Uh, do you have any? Oh no, I have one here. Never mind. Flux. Doc, I need to reconnect this guy up to power. There we go. All right, that's working. Nick, ethylene being produced. I can probably speed up the PRC as well. I've just been making uh, energy and speed upgrades. Oh, nice. Osmium. Go and crush some of that up here. Uh, is there like a limiting factor in our uh, in our storage creation? Are we like are we low on on anything here? Oh, um, nice. You're making fertilizer. You should uh, pipe that into a crate, Nick. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So that we can come back to more than nine stacks. Not that we, I don't think we're going to need more than no, nine stacks, no, but no. on four, the off chance that, the most. Uh, uh, but yeah. that we need it. Do yeah, these might as well, might as well store it. Foregoing machines automatically output their inventory, or do they have an option? No, they to? do not. They do not. No, no. Right. You have to use some kind of. Uh, you could just use a hopper. Yeah. Well, yeah. A hopper would work, though. Uh, so, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, our PRC is at max speed. Let's go ahead and get... I think the PRC auto outputs, right? Question uh, mark? Let's, we'll try. I'm not sure. I think it does. So, items... Yeah, you can turn auto eject on this one. Okay, so... Outputs... On. There we go. All right, Nick. HDPE pellets are being made very quickly. And they're also being put into the system. Uh, you need to export substrate, though, man. Yes, we do. Like, we into can't we that. Need to have substrate. Yeah. Yeah. Which 
is actually fine. I was going to say it could prove to be difficult because we have a free side, but we can repurpose uh, this side. That does mean we are going to have to put an export bus, uh, a storage bus even, on the um, the substrate, right? Uh, yes. Yes. To get but that, that out. Shouldn't, shouldn't be a problem. All right. Fertilizer, I think. Oh, no, this is for gold amber. How do you um, unlock a crate? Uh, Are you the key? Oh, you need a key. Okay. Uh, just take an empty. We've got empty crates in the system, Nick. Don't just use an empty crate, not a full one. <laughs> oh, no, this has nothing in it, but it's still locked. There, there yeah. were a ton of empty, unlocked crates in the system, Nick. Oh, okay. Well, we're good. We're so good. You we're can good. pick it's, from. It's doing it. Oh, no, there are. I've got them on in my inventory. My bad. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I took them that all was out. Just the, yeah. <laughs> it's all right. We've Whoops. got an unlocked crate and it's, it's working. Okay. Right. There we go. Poo Boom. is up, being made. Nice. I've also stored. just hooked up the 32,000 substrate. And so now that's being pumped. Uh, it's, it's accessible by the system. And so if I go ahead and throw that in here, tell it to export it, that should start doing that. And then if we get some acceleration cards. Ooh. Yep. Uh, let me lock this. There we go. There we go. So now I can craft these HDB pellets into sheets and rods. Oh, and yeah, there we make, go. here we go. Look at this, Nick. Look at this. 18, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Beautiful. We've got so much. The HDP is coming in so fast, Nick. Yeah. So fast. And we're at I love it. Uh, second best mulch, Isaac. We're at black. Nice. So we're doing well. Nice, and then nice, I, nice. I think next time I'll move on to the final form with uh, wither dust and blue slime crystals and whatnot. We, we freaking, we don't have enough, like, gosh dang, um, sides for this thing because we need to start, I think we have to output the oxygen. You see, the, it's, it's got an oxygen tank in there. That's filling up. I think we have to output that somewhere, right, to actually... Otherwise, it's going to stop working. Right. You know what I mean? And every side apart from the front is being used. Oh, my God. It would be nice if it could input it into itself, right? That would be lovely, Nick. Alas, I don't Not think a thing. it can. Um, yeah, there's a possibility, albeit an extremely low one, that if we set the side that you output gases to to the same side that you input gases to... No, yeah, it's not going to work. No. Um, <laughs> I think we just need to have, like, um, annoyingly, I think we just have to do something like this. Yeah. I just have gas export to the front. Right? Sure. Uh, gases auto eject on. Yeah, that's gone. And boom. There you go. And then, ideally, you'd want to put a, a storage bus on that gas tank, at which point it can loop itself back around and then can also be used to power our machines and whatnot. Um, between episodes, I might try Rika Jigger this because this setup is horrendous and I sure. hate it with every fiber of my being. Especially the fact that the HDPE pellets are built into this wooden pillar here is yeah. like horrendous. <laughs> that and, is uh, incredible. <laughs> it hurts my soul on so many levels, but uh, it's coming in so fast. I love it. We've got yeah, that's 400 good. We're going to have mulch already. Isaac next time. So much freaking mulch, Nick. We have to find a place to put all of the uh, the bonsai pots, Nick, uh, whether that be a new island or maybe a compact machine or something like that. Uh, we can figure that out. We can move all the stuff over. We can reset everything up to work on processing all of the uh, stuff that we get from the bonsai pots once again. Uh, we can maybe do with another um, deep mob learning setup, like a mm -hmm. replica of this, but to make wither skeleton skulls so that we can make the wither essence for the blue mulch. Although maybe we don't need to have it automated, right? Because we don't need that much blue mulch, right? Like maybe yeah. 20 at yeah, most. exactly. Um, so... We probably don't need like a full new system for it, Nick. That could work. Uh, like we're probably at what we term. need at this point, but uh, we'll leave it going. We're, HTB can't hurt. Let's do it. And um, we've already got 20 with the skeleton skulls. That might just be enough on its own. Yeah, for all of Considering it's a one needs. to three ratio. Yeah. Uh, we've got all of these uh, new pattern terminals, Nick, that are all nice and mm -hmm. colorful. Nick, finally, our offshore account is hooked up and ready to go. If you look inside of this ME interface, Nick, there's nothing there yet, but you can see Molecular Assembler mm -hmm. 6. They're all Six. online. And ready to go. And so finally, in the next episode, we can start to auto craft items. We can start to use the patterns to generate uh, craftable items. And then we can also start adding all of our machines to the, to the setup as well. Have them join the auto crafting team, Nick, and then eventually get to auto crafting what we need for a massive 24 by 24 by 24, which is actually like 56 by 56 by 56 nuclear 
fusion reactor, Nick, that'll produce hopefully 3.333333 million redstone flux per tick. But Ugh. as always, that is a problem for future Nick and future Isaac. For now, as always, if you did enjoy that video, please hit like. Be really just have a lot. Leave a comment down below. Subscribe if you're new here to get notified as soon as new videos go out. As always, thank you for watching. And we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.